And remember, Maxim Ultra Bark Mulch will stop those weeds dead in their tracks. See you next week on Gardens Galore. If Julian Acorn recommends Maxim Mulcho, it'll be just what I need to get my garden in shape for Beano Town in Bloom. We're off to the garden centre to get some. All right, dear, see you later. Oh, don't forget Nasha's bath. No problem, just leave it to me. And now the cup semi-final between Beano Town Wanderers and Drain. What ho? Seems friendly, but don't be fooled. When it comes to Beano Town in bloom, she's the enemy. Now, by the left, quick group. Dennis! Mum says Nasha needs a bath. Oh, Dad, do I have to do it? Oh, you know he always goes berserk. Sorry, Dennis, I'm really busy. I'll have to leave it to you. Nasha, you know sometimes we have to do stuff we don't like? I mean, I have to do me homework and tidy me room and eat sprouts and stuff. And sometimes you have to do stuff you don't like, like going to the vet. And having flea treatment. And having a bath. I should think you are. Not so much Beano Town in bloom, more bomb size on a bad day. <laughs> what are you talking about, Walter? Beano Town in bloom, the garden contest. Your mother was my main rival, but I'm sure to win now, thanks to you. <laughs> right, Nasha, that's it. We can't let Mum get beaten by Walter. Somehow, we've got to get this garden fixed up again. <laughs> Curly, call Pie Face and get over here. I've got a gardening emergency. <laughs> what? Uh, what's with the horse? He's looking after it for his cousin. But ever since he's got it, he's been acting weird. What? Weirder than usual? He won't answer you unless you call him the Pie Crust Kid. OK, OK, fair enough. So, Pie Crust Kid, what's with the horse? This here's my Palomino, Sylvia. Pie Horse, Sylvia! <laughs> oh, what was that all about? She does it every time I say, Hi, ho, Sylvia. <laughs> well, stop saying it then. It's not good, is it? Not good at all, Curly. I darn toot and don't see how. <gasps> uh, what I mean is, we'll never get it back to how it was. No kidding, Pie Face. Hang on, he's onto something. We can't fix it, so maybe we should try something totally different. You mean like bigger? Better? More spectacular? That's the plan. Once again, Genius wears a striped sweater. Beano Town Towers? A stately home garden? Exactly. We'll make one just like it. Set smaller. Garden. Stately? <laughs> In a state more like. <laughs> it just needs an extra something. <laughs> and I know just the something it needs. 
a pinch of down home prairie fertilizer. Manu, my dad says you can't beat it. Hmm. Well, go on then. <laughs> <laughs> What's happened to the garden? Dennis! What have you done? The garden's your mother's pride and joy. I know, Dad. Sorry. I was trying to give Nasha a bath, like you said, and it all got out of hand. I should have bathed him myself. This is all my fault. Don't worry, Dad. We'll think of something. There's no time, Dennis. We'll just have to face the music. You two can go home. No sense in us all getting into trouble. OK. See you then. Right. Best be off then. See ya. You're bound to win Beano Town in Bloom, Walter. Your garden looks super. Well, it's going to look even better this afternoon because it's getting a makeover from Julian Acorn, the man from Gardens Galore. Golly, does your dad know him? No, my uncle does. Once he's added the finishing touch, my garden will be sure to win the grand prize. Ha! Here, that's not fair! Best tell done. Hi! I mean, come on, Sylvia. So, Walter's getting Julian Acorn in. Cos his uncle knows him. And, and it's cheating, isn't it? Hang on, did you say Walter's uncle knows him, not his dad? Yeah? Get into many small boys. I can feel a plan coming on. As soon as Nasha sees the TV van, he signals to Curly, OK? Then Curly signals to you and you alert me, right? Got yeah. It. Right, get into position. Ooh. It's on his way, pie face. Under control. Right. Ready, Dad? Remember, you're supposed to be Walter's dad. No problem. Delighted to meet you, Mr. Acorn. Hi, I'm Julian Acorn. Uh, you must be Walter. Yes. How do you do, Mr. Acorn? And you must be Walter's dad. Indubitably. Delighted to meet you, Mr. Acorn. We're big fans, are we not, De uh, Walter? Oh, yes. Double indubitably. Gardens Galore is my very favourite programme. Great. Well, then, uh, let's take a look at your garden. Hmm, it's a tricky one, but uh, we'll see what we can do. Hello, anybody home? Out here, dear. Ta da! <gasps> My garden! It looks. fantastic! Yes, thanks to Mr. Acorn here. Mwah, mwah. Delighted to meet you, dear lady. Oh, oh, Mr. Acorn. Oh, thank you so much. <laughs> but how... I mean, why did you pick my garden for a makeover? Well, apparently it was all the idea of your little lad Walter here. His uncle called me. But my son's not called Walt. Oh, Dennis! So, who won Beano Town in Bloom, then? The Colonel. The judges said he had a very disciplined approach. Your mum would have won if she'd gone in for it, though. Yeah, but you know mum. As the garden had a professional makeover, she thought it'd be cheating if she entered. At least Walter didn't win. Not very likely, Pie Face, seeing as you totally lost control of Sylvia. <laughs> <laughs> There's just one thing left to do. What's that, Dan? Nash's bath. <laughs> oh, 
Okay, Nasha. Prepare to meet the Fleaminator. Are you sure this will work? Of course. Like the catalogue says, it's anti-flea science in a high-tech appliance. <laughs> Just a touch more power to pick up the stragglers. <laughs> Is that supposed to happen? Not according to the manual. <laughs> I'm sorry, but that dog will have to stay out of my lovely clean house until his fleas have gone. For good! Oh, don't worry, Nasha. Dad'll find a way. for today. But I was just warming up. Dennis, now before you go, I have an announcement to make regarding the school dance competition. Dance competition? Blech. This year, Athena's father, Mr uh, Rat Bucket Kane, has kindly donated an award. Oh, Rat Bucket! All hail the King of Rock bass players! And as well as helping me judge the contest, Athena will be presenting the prize to the winner. I will win. It's my destiny. Please tell me that's a joke. I can dance. Well, if you can dance, Pie Face, you must know these moves. And you've got to know this one. It's the latest thing. Oh, yeah. But, well, I... Uh... <laughs> Him! Dance! I don't think so. <laughs> Dancing is about graceful movement, elegance and finesse. If Pie Face won, I'd... I'd eat my socks. <laughs> <laughs> A sock swallowing Walter. Now that I've got to see. <laughs> Well, you better bring your knife and fork to the dance then, cos Pie Face is going to win. And you know why? Do tell. Because he's got the best dance teachers on the planet. Oh, really? And who would they be? Me and Nasha. All right, Pie Face, we'd better go back to basics. Anything done, as long as I get to win. I mean, backstage passes for a rap bucket concert. Wow. Hey, if I'd known that was a prize, I'd have gone in for it myself. But meanwhile, we've got to make sure you win. Yeah. Well, I reckon I should do... I know. The... Disco. I'll add Dennis and Nasha. Some heavy rock. <laughs> right, Pie Face. There's three dances you could do. What do you think? Oh, great. Now what are we gonna do? <laughs> Good idea, Nasha. We'll check out the opposition. Attention, dancers. At the sound of the music. Dance! Lift, right, lift, right. You there, keep it up. But, but these metal tip shoes are so heavy, sir. Never mind the shoes. What's our motto? The harder, the harder we, we work, work our feet, feet the harder, harder we'll be to beat. beat. Uh-oh. The Colonel's got Walter and his pals dancing like a well-drilled platoon. Pie Face is going to have his work cut out to beat them. This new flea magnetizer will do the trick, Nasha. All we have to do is give the fleas a puff of magno dust <laughs> and then turn on the magnetizer. <laughs> Victory! It's starting to work. Cool! Let's pump up the power. Uh, no, Dennis. <laughs> oh, too much power. Maybe it's time to wake Pie Face for his next lesson? Dennis! <laughs> right, Pie Face. Which dance then? The dance I want to do. 
My granddad taught it me when I was a kid. Oh, OK. What is it, then? The Dance of the Seven Pies. The what? Oh, I'll show you. Give me some music, Curly. <laughs> Cool. That's good enough for me. <coughs> Roll on the dance contest. Something tells me Pie Face is going to need a little extra help. <laughs> My boys are fighting fit, Mrs. Creature. They'll beat anything the enemy can throw at them. Well, we'll find out very shortly, Colonel. The dance contest is about to begin. Now to give Pie Face a little extra help. I'll just give Walter and his pals dancing shoes a blast of magno dust. <laughs> so they respond to Dad's magnetizer. And Pie Face will be all set to win. Where have you been? I thought you'd gone home. What? I missed my star pupil picking up his prize. Don't worry, Pie Face. You and me are going to be front row at the Rat Bucket gig. And now to our first contestants. Let's hear a big hand for... Walter, Bertie and Dudley. <laughs> Uh-oh. They look like they know what they're doing. Like I say, Pie Face, don't worry about a thing. Shoulders back, keep a stiff upper lip and dance. <laughs> What's wrong with you chaps? Dance! Dance! That's an order! We can't! Our feet are stuck! <laughs> Not for long! Do steps aren't part of our routine? Neither are these! Oh, 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 oh. Come on! Level training! Harder will be to beat! Harder will be to beat! That wasn't supposed to happen. Thank you, Walter, Bertie and Dudley. That will certainly take some beating for originality. Oh, great. Right, Nasha. <laughs> this automatic flea-seeking comb will definitely do the trick. And as soon as we're done, you can go and see Dennis at the school dance contest. <laughs> right. Lock and load. Those fleas are doomed. Nasha! Nasha! Come back! And now, for the final contestant tonight... It's Pie Face with the Dance of the Seven Pies! We're going to need a miracle to win now! <laughs> Nasha! <laughs> Please detected. Subject clear. Well done, Nasha. It looks like you and Dad finally beat the fleas after all. Hey, what's going on? <laughs> wow, what kind of dance is that? That? Oh, that's uh, the flea. The flea? Yeah, it's the latest thing. You must have heard of it. It's in all the magazines. Oh, yeah, right, the flea. I do it all the time. It's cool. That's it. You've got it. Come on, everybody, join in. Let's all do the flea. <sighs> well, after that amazingly inspiring display, I'm sure we're all agreed that there can only be one winner of this year's dance contest. I'm happy to present first prize. Four VIP backstage passes to the Rat Bucket concert to... Here are our dancing shoes, Colonel. We won't be needing them anymore. Better take your socks off too, Walter. I'll be tasty with a little ketchup. <laughs> oh dear.
It. Allergic to his own pet. We'll get Nasha back from Beano Town Kennels just as soon as we find a cure for your allergy to dogs, Dennis. Okay, Dad. How about we have a pizza for a snack? You can have it in your room if you like. Ha <laughs> <laughs> ha! Result! <laughs> Brilliant! <gasps> it's Dennis! <laughs> Whoa! Whoa! Watch it, pie face! Sorry. Falling, falling. Right, men, we know why we're here. Yes, sir! Dennis, sir! Yes, uh, no, uh, what's happening, sir? I'll recap. And this time, pay attention at the back. So, Nasha was taking Nipper, his beloved pup, for a walk in the park. In an obvious case of mistaken identity, Nipper was accused of stealing sausages and hauled off to Beano Town Kennels. Nasha was devastated. Of course he was. We've got to get Nipper back. I'm ahead of you, Curly. Plan A is already in full swing. Gentlemen, I give you Operation Breakout. Mum and Dad think I'm allergic to dogs, so... Nasha has been taken to Beano Town Kennels, which is obviously a really horrible place. Somewhere inside is poor, half-starved Nipper. Nasha will find him, of course. He'll probably go crazy when he sees how Nipper's suffering. Then, first chance he gets, he'll break out of there and bring Nipper back to us. Meanwhile, we wait for Dad to bring us treats. Incoming pizza! You better get back to your sick bed. Right. <sighs> huh? oh. Here we are, son. All right. I, I mean. Thanks, Dad. There! Uh, I mean, uh, oh! Uh, your rash seems to be getting worse. <coughs> oh, must be the, uh, all the dog airs in here. You better give this place a, a bit of a clean up. <laughs> oh. This is weird. It's been ages since they took Nasha. I'd have thought he'd be back with Nipper by now. Oh, Dennis. What is it, Pie Face? Have you got an idea? Yeah. Could you get your dad to bring you a pie next time? Poor Dennis. He's really missing Nasha. He's not the only one. I never thought I'd say this, but I miss my slippers being half chewed. They're more comfy that way. And with no dog to beware of, it seems like the whole of Beano Town is coming to our door. Nasha does do a good job of keeping people away. Without him, I can't get a moment's peace. It must be tough in that kennel if Nasha hasn't broken out yet. His teeth can gnash through anything. <gasps> oh. I miss my dog. For the hundredth time, I do not need a musical toilet brush, nor do I need a Mexican poncho, a garden gnome for all seasons, or a patio thermometer. Oh, I miss that dog. Nasha must be trapped in the kennel, and it's all my fault. I have to get him out. But how? <sighs> it's time for Plan B. Woof, woof. Uh, 
etc, etc. Oi! You nasty little brute! Give me back my sausages! Oh, easy, mate! Help! Help! This dog tried to steal my sausages! Naughty dog! Naughty, naughty dog! Oh! oh my face! All right, dog. Let's be having you, you little troublemaker. Right? What the? Oh. Ah. Ruff, ruff. Here I am, in the van. Woof, woof. Best place for you, naughty sausage thief. Oh. Right, who did that? It was a naughty boy, a very naughty boy. Oh, it was, was it? Well... At least we've got the naughty dog. Gave himself up without a fight, I see. Obviously feeling guilty. Woof, woof. I should think so too. Right, it's the kennels for you, my lad. Everything. I ground them into myself. <laughs> Something tells me Nasher has had enough. Dennis, Dennis, are you okay? Dennis, where? where's it? of your favourite num-nums. <laughs> Lovely saucy wassages. <laughs> and when you've eaten your num-nums, <laughs> you can put on your special cosy wassies. <laughs> That's me dog. <laughs> My precious needlework. <laughs> Ruined. Ungrateful mongrel. Uh, I'll choose a new favourite doggy. Uh-oh. Pretended to be allergic to dogs, did you? Get your own dog hauled off to the kennels, would you? Just to get us to wait on your hand and foot, eh? Well, now it's your turn. Love, hope it's nice and strong. Oh, and don't forget that special treat for the boys. <coughs> Poor old Nasher, sent away to the kennels for no good reason. <gasps> Here's some lovely sausages for you. <laughs> Help yourselves to those, eh, Nasher? And you, Nipper. <coughs> Go on, have as many as you want. <laughs> 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 What is it, 
found the ideal material for our new kitchen curtains. Look. Oh, yes. Very nice, dear. And it was the very last piece they had. It's perfect! I'll have my dream kitchen at last! Oh, you haven't got far with the painting, though, have you? I'm taking extra special care, dear. You can't rush a good job, you know. Hmm. All right. I'll go and look for curtain rails. Bye! Whatever you do, don't let anything happen to that material. <laughs> of course not, dear. I'll guard it with me life. Shame about the kite, Nasha. But it wasn't big enough anyway. <laughs> no. What we need is a big sail so we can go really fast. <laughs> <laughs> to make a sail for my skateboard. Got any ideas? Why, uh, what? Hey! Can I use that? Uh, yeah. Cool! Thanks, Dad! to it, we'll both be in big trouble. Come on, Nasha. We've got to get back before Mum does. Yeah! Dreadful little gutter snipe. Total lack of discipline. I blame the parents. Oh, where's Mum's material? <laughs> Uh, sorry about that, Colonel. Sorry? It's taken me years to get this so perfect. Years! And now look at it! Ruined! Um, I, I couldn't possibly have me sail back, could I? No, you can't. I'm confiscating it. It's a danger to public safety, and so are you! But you can't do that! It's not yours! Can't I? Watch me! No! Wait! Hello? Dennis, where are you? Are you bringing that material back? Yeah, I'll be right there, Dad. Just uh, um, having a chat with the Colonel. Oh, right, Nasha, this is getting serious. <laughs> well, might as well get some use out of it. I've always wanted a hammock. <laughs> Magnificent. That's well out of order. Right. Surely he doesn't think I'm going to fall for that old trick. So the little ruffian wants a battle of wits, does he? Well, he's going to find he's bitten off more than he can chew. Where 
is that boy? <laughs> and take your rubbish with you! <laughs> right. The little pest thinks he's so clever. Let's see how he copes with this. Come and get it now, if you dare. <laughs> he hasn't reckoned with your mighty munch power, has he, Natcher? <laughs> And I know how to get there without him seeing us. <laughs> have to stay calm. <laughs> stay calm. <laughs> breathe. Don't forget to breathe. <gasps> hmm. No sign of him. What's he up to, eh? We must be there. I can feel something. We'll have to get it out the way. Go on, Nasha. Do your stuff. <laughs> Find something to block it. Oh dear. <laughs> oh. oh. would love to help, wouldn't you? Of course, Dad. Go and get the material then, son. Oh, no. Not that one. What? I changed my mind. I thought we'd have this one instead. What do you think? Competing in the big dog show in the park. You want to enter Nasha too? I don't know, Gran. Dog shows aren't really Nasha's thing. <coughs> There'll be lots of other dogs there. <coughs> nah, he still doesn't fancy it. It's sponsored by Butch Butcher. There's a load of sausages for the winner. <coughs> <laughs> That'll be a yes then. <laughs> Dennis, this is the competitor's 
entrance. Yeah, so? Well, I hardly think your mass is fit to compete. <laughs> All this other mongrel. <laughs> oh, yeah? Well, check these out. Official entry forms for Nasha and Nipper. <sighs> Honestly, they're letting in any old riffraff these days. Now that's more like it. Look at Miss Miniwoof. Just the kind of classy dog we want in the show. Uh, uh, hello, Athena. Uh, hello, Miss Miniwoof. <laughs> oh, Walter, can't you get rid of those creatures? Cheek. Who do they think they are? Exactly. Oh, come on, Walter. Let us in. I suppose I'll have to. But keep those two away from the other pedigree contestants. We don't want them all catching fleas. Ladies and gentlemen, we come to the talent section of the show to be judged by the mayor, Mrs. Creature, and, of course, our sponsor, Butch Butcher, purveyor of Beano Town's finest sausages. Please welcome our first competitor, Mrs. Bonzilla Barkington Wagstaff and Los Chihuahuas Bonzilleros. Right, Nasha and Nipper. Talent? Ooh, let me see. Uh, dirt magnets? <laughs> They've got plenty of talent. They're going to wipe the floor with the other dogs. <laughs> Judging by their appearance, it looks as if you've wiped the floor with them. <laughs> There's nothing wrong with the way they look. Hmm, well, it's my job to marshal the contestants. Any infringement of the rules by these two and they'll be out. <laughs> Gentlemen. They scored nine out of ten for pedigree in the first round. And I'd give them at least eight for originality. Don't you think, Mr Butcher? Oh, um, uh, I think they must have been too small to see. That's what chihuahuas are, Mr Butcher. Very small. No, I mean, I've lost my glasses. Oh, uh, I had them a minute ago. Good luck, Athena. And you, Miss Miniwolf. I hope you win. And now, the height of fashion, Athena Kane and Miss Miniwolf. <clears throat> Very stylish, I think you'll agree. Wow, major talent. They can both walk without falling over. <laughs> Miss Miniwolf scored nine for pedigree. I'll, uh, I'll give her six for talent. And switch. <laughs> what, Nasha? That's awesome. <laughs> Standing on hind legs? Hmm, I'm not sure that's allowed. Oh, give it a rest, Walter. I'm keeping an eye on you. I loved your act, Athena. Uh, so chic. <laughs> Don't worry, Nasha. We'll show those snooty dog owners a thing or two. <laughs> Say hello to Beano Town's favourite policeman, Sergeant Slipper, and his canine cop, Biter. Biter is a highly trained law enforcement specialist. <laughs> at, uh, at the north end of the field, you will see Constable Coughdrop. Posing as a dangerous uh, criminal perpetrator type villain. Now, watch as Biter makes the arrest. Go, boy! Apprehend that suspicious person. <laughs> 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 Apprehend her! Oh, oh, she's the perpetrator! <laughs> Even you're more obedient than Biter. <laughs> Pedigree was in order, but zero for talent, I think. No, I, 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 I didn't really get a good look. Um, oh. That's because you were facing the wrong way, Mr Butcher. And now our final 
competitors, Nipper and uh, Nasha. <laughs> They'll probably just be chasing their own tails. <laughs> Good luck, boys. Think of the sausages. <laughs> Well, Gran, if you ask me, Nasha and Nipper have the talent show in the bag. Oh, my goodness! These beastly creatures might actually win! Uh, uh, there must be some rule against motorbike riding! Uh, oh, yes! Marvellous idea, Athena! By gosh, I, I do, I do believe you're right. That motorised vehicle is exceeding the speed limit. Biter, arrest those lawbreakers. This is not good, Gran. Not good at all, Dennis. Walter, it's only a dog show. Yes, well, all the other dogs have got proper pedigrees. So luckily, you've got no chance of winning. Now, ladies and gentlemen, it's time to present the Best in Show trophy, which has been kindly presented by Mr Butch Butcher. Oh, I wish I had my glasses. Oh. Here they are, Mr Butcher. Remember, best in show goes to the dog with most points for talent and pedigree. Under consideration are... Police Dog Biter, Los Chihuahuas Bouncy Leros, Nasha and Nipper, and finally, Miss Miniwolf. And the winner is... Miss Miniwolf! <laughs> I knew we would do it, my poochie witchy. Oh. class of dog. <laughs> oh, hang on a minute. Uh, now I've found my glasses, I can see the entry form. It says here that Nasha is an Abyssinian wire-haired tripe hound. Really? A tripe hound? The rarest breed of all? Well, that's different. Uh, bring your dog up here, boy. What? Why is that different? If you groomed your dog up occasionally, we would have seen he's a very special breed. Of course he's special. He's my best mate. But that dog has no talent. Well, uh, not just your best uh, mate, but also I'm delighted to announce he's the best in show. <laughs> this is an Rage. Come on, sweetie. We don't need this stupid dog show anyway. I don't believe it. This has to be some kind of mistake. Rage up, Masha. You're wrong. <laughs> 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 